Ooh. It is time for Samara's loyalty mission part one. Because I'm gonna play it twice. And right here we have some special mods, first of all for Samara. Uh, white Paladin body armor and then for her spouse we got her a new mod that came out a few weeks ago Aria has, work. Aria has a job she needs doing you up for some work that depends on what Aria has in mind Aria's gotten word that some blood packed mercs plan to kill an old acquaintance of hers a Krogan named Patriarch she'd like you to keep that from happening why come to me? Arya's usual muscle not up for the job? Because Arya said so. What other reason do you need? If Arya wants my help, she'd better tell me why. I'm not doing this for my help. Fine. Whatever gets you to take the job. If it gets out that Arya's protecting Patriarch, well, that can look like a weakness. And some people might want to exploit that. You're not on a payroll, so you helping Patriarch just seems like a random act of kindness. What's the Blood Pack's problem with Patriarch? If you've met Patriarch, you know. He can't keep his damn mouth shut. Some people don't appreciate his stories, especially when he dips into non-fiction. I'll look into it. Good. Patriarch's downstairs, likely surrounded by his fans. Get him into hiding until the mercs move on. Come back here when it's done, and you'll get your due. I'll be back when the job is done. Good luck. Okay, let's do that real quick. That doesn't take long, I believe. Especially when I make one of those options. Oh, that's the wrong room. I believe. Was it? Friendly? Yeah, no? <laughs> Our hands are beautiful. Apparently, I'm going the right way. It's in down the bar then. Human failure. Oh, wait. It's happening, ladies and gentlemen. We're drinking. Once and only once in the Mass Effect trilogy. Ah, oh, I just feel like now is the only right time to drink something. Otherwise, I don't drink something. But right now, we needed a bit, a bit of juice. Oh, we're dancing already. Shepard, are you all right? Oh, it feels so great. How much did I drink? One drink. That's all it takes. That racist Batarian bastard. Looks like you broke the first rule of Omega. Don't order a drink at Afterlife if you're human. That bartender tried to poison me? Tried is the word. As far as I know, you're the first human to survive it. Me and my friend Jake went there to celebrate our new shipping business. He got real drunk, and an hour later, he was puking blood. Humans aren't welcome at Afterlife? It's just that one Batarian bartender. He's got a stick up his ass about a bunch of Batarians that died a while back. No one does a thing about it, though. Humans ain't exactly held in high regard around here. I think I'll go give that bartender a taste of his own medicine. He won't be expecting you, that's for sure. Give that Batarian bastard what he deserves. <laughs> Where's Samara? Oh. Am I? Oh, don't they normally bring you to the toilet in this cutscene? I could have sworn they bring you to the toilet. What is that, a human? I'm still lost around here. 
Yep, wrong. Sources say that the Asari Shaira, more commonly known as the Consort, may be leaving the Citadel after years of bad press and rumors of intelligence leaks. The Shepherd Scholarship has gone into effect, targeting low income children on Earth, where the most huh. famous human in the galaxy allegedly had a difficult childhood. Bam. Am I in the right place this time, or is it the wrong place again? Wait, is that where the Patriarch is? Yeah, okay, good. First bartender though. Otherwise it's glitched again. Do I know you? No, no, humans all look the same. Here, have a drink on the house. What? What? You drank? You should be dead! Wait! You don't want me to! Now, drink it. I... no, you can't. I... Drink it, or I'll blind you one eye at a time. Oh, maybe she should have just ran away. Maybe she should have just ran away. No, you said he had close family. They'll just want revenge. Kill the family first. Then he'll get angry and come at you stupid. And then you kill him. I don't think I know you, human. I'm the Patriarch. Arius Patriarch. What do you want? I should be going. No. Nah. You are the real. Greetings. Some people want you dead. I've been asked to move you to safety. Well, of course. Arya wouldn't want me hurt. It would make her look bad. But perhaps Arya's reputation is no longer my concern. Perhaps I will stay. See who thinks me important enough to kill. You allow Arya to protect you like you're her pet? I thought you were a Krogan. Arya let me live. She gave me a position of honor as her advisor. She gave you a position of comfort as her trophy. Is that what you want? Or would you rather go down fighting? I wish she killed me the day she beat me. That would have been a glorious death. But perhaps it is not too late to die well. Perhaps these assassins will remember my name. Farewell, human, and thank you. Where's she going? Where is she going? <laughs> oh, okay, whatever happened to Renegade. Oh, even Paragon. He's Omega's number one citizen. But what do we really know about her? Apparently nothing. That's where the sentence stops. You. Arya wants to speak with you, human. Something about Patriarch taking on a squad of mercs by himself. I wouldn't keep her waiting. I heard my old friend Patriarch died. Went out in a blaze of glory. Oh, he does. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? I gave him what you could the chance to die like a crow. That wasn't your decision to make. His life belonged to me. Patriarch was dead for centuries. You know that. How he was? I'd almost forgotten he was a Krogan. You gave him the death he deserved. What? You've done a lot for me, Shepard. Let me return the favor. We're sending your coordinates to a cache on an uncharted world. You want it? It's yours. What's the catch? No catch. I don't need it, and I don't want it to go to waste. Whatever you find is yours to deal with. Mm. Sounds like you and Patriarch have a history. Our history is Omega's history. Long, bloody, and always ending in my favor. The details, 
are complicated. When I arrived, Omega was lawless, a land of opportunity. I built alliances and destroyed the fools who wouldn't get in line, which was most of them. But Patriarch, he was something different. A powerful friend. I assume you decided he was too strong, even as an ally? No. He cast the first stone. It wasn't a surprise when he turned. He controlled the muscle. My people contributed more subtle action. Espionage, politics, assassination. Fortunately for me, his men had become accustomed to certain benefits of working with Asari. Sounds like you changed the rules and the battlefield. Krogan nature made it easy for us to take advantage. Patriarch's men abandoned him in droves. In the end, we fought face to face on this very spot. The toughest fight of my life. But of course I won. So you kept him around as a trophy? I did. A trophy and an example. Whenever someone thought about taking me on, I pointed them to Patriarch. I suppose I still can. Patriarch doesn't sound like something an Asari would come up with. I found it humorous. He wanted power. And we pretended he had it with a word that doesn't exist for my people. I eventually found a certain respect for the title and the man. Interesting, but let's move on. Do you need something else? An Asari fugitive is hiding out here. She's an Ardat Yakshi. We need to find her. I knew it. Nothing leaves a body quite so empty as an Ardat Yakshi does. You haven't taken steps to kill her. Why would I? She hasn't tried to seduce me. Her last victim was a young girl. Pretty thing. Lived in the tenements near here. That's where I'd start looking. Thanks for the help. Good luck finding her. Better luck catching her. Don't you worry, I have all the moths in order. Okay. The living rooms, which are around the corner to my left, I believe. No, oh, I've been always been good looking, I swear. Hidden stairs. We gotta check that out. Actually, we don't. Come on, Not yet. the right way I hope it's not that easy to find I don't think that's uh, I need to go upstairs first maybe there's sworn it's in here emotions at Shepard's rumored survival are mixed while some are overjoyed to see him return others believe his false death was a betrayal Miranda Lawson I thought that might be you hello ish long time no see I take it you've met each other before Jacob and I worked a mission with ish a few years back he helped us with some information. One of my finer moments, I'd say. I take it you've met each other before. Well, come Jacob on. and I worked a mission with Ish a few years One of my finer moments, I'd say. What's the thing? Is this going to be a problem? I've worked with Ish a few times. He's a coward and a liar. But he's useful enough. I heard you talking about us. What do you want? Please, please. We're all friends here. There's no need for language of that sort. I need skilled, trustworthy people to take care of a little business for me. Nothing illegal, of course, but it's paying work. What kind of business do you do? Important business. So important that, with your help, we can change Omega. I'm listening. I'm in the information business, specifically the buying and selling of privileged material. It's nothing illicit. I just need someone to pick up packages in certain locations and bring them to me here. Why? What's your angle? No angle. I'm a simple businessman. What do you say? I can do that. My contacts use specific drop points. I need you to look outside Merib's shop on the Citadel and inside Eternity on Ilium. Look oh around for anything that might hold a data package and bring those packages to me. Good seeing you again, Merib. I won't do that. What's it this? This must be it. Hey, look, no people here. 
with no voice lines. And I got excited there for a second. I was like, where? Are you here about my daughter? My nephew died a week ago and no one seems to care. The medic said it was a brain hemorrhage, but that's not true. It was murder. Someone killed my nephew, my baby. I think she was murdered too, and I'm looking for her killer. Oh, thank you. It's so hard when no one believes you. I'm all alone now. Are you one of Arya's people? I'm looking into this on my own authority. No one else on this hellhole station gives a damn that my nephew is dead. If you can do something about it, I'll help you however I can. Do you mind if I examine Neff's room? I didn't want to disturb anything. Her clothes, her art, her sculptures, everything is the way she left it. The way it will always be. Okay. My baby is gone. Nope. She's gone. And nothing will fix that. Why no did hawks. this happen? We need to look in your daughter's room. Nothing will be disturbed. <laughs> I'll try. But if my investigation requires it, I'll do what I have to do. Please try. <laughs> For me. Please. I'll examine her things. Oh. <laughs> oh. The hell was that? Ah, okay. There's a toilet in her personal room. Interesting. That, uh, that space marker. Guilty. Neff made that. A man from some gallery offered me four years' salary for it. But I'd never part with it. You stupid. Neff, I'm sending you this hologram by the Elcor artist Forta. His work is sublime. But don't stare at it too long or you may go mad. I don't want anything bad to happen to you, love. I can't wait to hear what you think of Forta. Read the middle entry. Cycle 36, orbit 671. Oh, am I a freak? Morinth is a girl like me, and she's definitely not human. Just when we dance and the Halix is flowing through me, the way she looked, no one's ever looked at me like that. We Read the newest tonight. entry. Cycle 42, orbit 67. She's going to take me to her apartment tonight. Whatever happens, I want to be with her forever. She can sell my pieces. We can live somewhere. How did this happen to me? I'm just dumb trash from Omega. Read the oldest entry. Hey, diary. Cycle. I dropped your root's name, and they let me into the VIP room at Afterlife. I was sure everyone was staring at me. Then the most beautiful Asari starts dancing near me. She moves like, then I'm dancing with her. Later, we went for skewers, and I'm supposed to see her again tomorrow. Close the hollow journal. This is Morin's work. She's attracted to artists and creators. Someone with a spark slightly isolated from their peers. She impresses with sophistication and sex appeal. And she strikes. The hunt interests her as much as the conquest. She kills with sex, and I have no plans to sleep with her. Perhaps you have a right to be glib, Shepard. But caution is wise here. Morin speaks to you on many levels. Her body tells yours that she'll bring unimaginable ecstasy. Her scent evokes emotions long hidden. Her eyes promise you things you were always scared to ask of another. Her voice whispers to you after she is done speaking. <laughs> she sounds like my kind of a sorry. You joke, Shepard. But for all your might, you will be in great danger. Storming her den would be a mistake. She will have a hundred escape routes planned. She will go to ground and disappear for 50 years or more. This is the closest I've ever been. You sound like you're working your way toward an idea. Afterlife's VIP section seems her preferred hunting ground. You must go there alone and unarmed. She'll come after me. You can draw Morinth out. She'll certainly flee if she catches sight of me, but she won't be able to resist you. You are an artist on the battlefield. You have the vital spark that attracts her. Your power will draw her in. Right, right. And those red eyes. I'm walking into this place with no gun and no backup? I will be in the shadows watching, Shepard. You will never be alone. This I swear. But you cannot barge in with guns and allies. 
Marinth is far too cagey. She'd simply disappear. This is a subtle, delicate act. Trust can me. We have, can we have Jacob, shirtless Jacob, as a backup plan? Please. I don't want to die. Time's wasting. Let's get over there. I agree. We can talk more once we're there. Can we also take Miranda? Let's back up. Um, that's upstairs, I believe, through the door I couldn't go through. After life, VIP area, maybe it's downstairs here. Okay. Out of the way. Humans are applied on galactic pure. Yeah. I'm applied. Increase weapon damage. Increase melee. Increase storm speeds. Full max. What? Oh, increase weapon damage. Okay. Oh. What do you want? What's behind this door? The VIP section of the club. For those with the right name. Do you want something? Someone told me the rest of Afterlife is nothing compared to this place. Sounds like a smart person. Who was it? Jeruth. Go on in. Word to the wise. Start a fight, we'll hurt you. Someone attacks you, it's okay to defend yourself. Oh, I've, I've downloaded some mod that should make this easier. <laughs> Very well hidden. Where's Miranda? You must go in alone. Marinth will be watching. Like any predator, she is cautious. You must pique her interest enough that she will approach you. When you are face to face, subtly encourage her to invite you to her apartment. I'll follow discreetly, and when you are alone, I'll spring the trap. Know this, until I get there, you are in great peril. She will be planning to inflict horrors on you. If you are not careful, you will want her to. I could have sworn her face thing is white beforehand. I don't need the tips. I'm Let's manic. get started. Shepard, we only get one chance at this. Any mistake and Morinth will disappear. If you're the least bit unsure, come talk to me. I will wait here. And Shepard, thank you. I do not share this burden easily, and you are the only soul I can imagine sharing it with. Why is it red all of the sudden? Lit up, attract more and I'm just gonna dance. Hey, who are you? Hey, do you know where to get tickets for Expel 10? I heard this amazing Asari say they were her favorite band. I want I just want whatever she wants. I gotta find tickets. Expel 10 is playing tomorrow. What kind of music do they play? They're a sensory band. Like, they crawl into you and make you feel things. And this Asari digs them like you wouldn't believe. I could score way out of my league, you know? You, you gotta help me. She sounds amazing. Is she here? She was here a couple of days ago talking about the band. She's here a lot. When she comes back, I'm gonna have tickets. I'm ready to punch someone, and you're too close. Relax, relax. It's cool. I'll step off. All right, I get for life. It's hot. Sweaty. Where's the dance floor? Come on, baby. I can pay. Don't be like that. I got credits. We'll go back to my place. I got simple tastes. Back <laughs> off, asshole. I'm a dancer, not a hooker. You got a mouth on you. I'll enjoy watching you use it. The lady asked you to step away. What the hell? I'm just looking for a good time. This isn't your business. Oh! Good times are over. Thanks for that. Security was asleep. Yeah. What's the dance floor? Dance. Hey. Hey. I'll dance next to you. If you want to think we're dancing together, go ahead. I do want to think that. 
Oh, no stop dog. Oh. What else is dirty too? The All the drinks. Bunch. I guess they'll let anybody in here now. No standards anymore. Can you back that up? We go out to the alley, only one of us comes back in. Drink here, no need to get all excited. Damn humans. Oh, oh so many renegade points. I, I, get lots of I do, I do. What'll you have? These are good people, but they look bored. Bored people don't spend much. And you got an idea for how I could fix that? A round of drinks shows that you appreciate their business. Your rep will improve, and you'll make more money in the end. Maybe worth a try once. You better be right. Listen up, everyone! We love having you here, so a round of drinks on the house! Ah, oh, I'm just farming renegade points here. Just farming renegade points here. Lots of money on display here tonight. Good cred hunting tonight. We'll hit him in the alley. As long as it isn't one of Arya's people, we're good. We oh. gotta get enough creds to keep Hink off our backs. Hey, what are you looking at? A pair of sad losers who think they're something, and are about to find out they're not. <laughs> Who's gonna show us that? You? A human thinks he's a tough guy. Tougher than you. Right in the balls. Ah, all the renegade points in my pockets. All of them. All fin. Uh, hi. I need help right now, and I don't know who to ask. You're human, and you don't look high, so you're it. Can you help me out? Oh. Slow down and tell me what the problem is. Right. Slow down. Sorry, I, I just don't know what to do. My friend Moiral is doing a piece on Omega Games. She's hanging with Florid. He's the worst of the worst. Doing a what? What is she doing? A vid piece. She's an investigative reporter, you know? She's trying to profile gang leaders. Your friend could get hurt. Yeah, and she's going to. See, Florid's on to her. His gang is on the way here, and they're going to make a mess of her. I have to get a message to her, and fast. You seem to have a lot of information. I'm her tech. I've been monitoring the gang's calm. The last transmission said Florit's going to splatter her. Man, I'm a tech junkie. I don't know how to handle this. What do you want me to do? She and I have a code. If you go over and say two words to Florit, my friend will get the message and get out of there. The two words are terminal and eternity. In that order. Please tell me you can do that. She's going to die. I can do that. Thank you. Thank you. Remember, terminal and eternity. In that order, just work them into a sentence. Terminal eternity. Terminal eternity. Terminal eternity. Terminal eternity. Terminal eternity. Terminal eternity. You need something, man? Is there a public extranet terminal around here? In a club? You don't have an Omni tool? That is a pretty strange question. I get by on public terminals. My Omni tool's been broken for an eternity. That's a tough break. I'm done talking to you now. Hey, Florit. I have to pee. Yeah? Hurry back, Moirol. I'm ready to head out. My name is Morin. I've been watching you. You're the most interesting person in this place. I've got a booth over here in the shadows. Why don't you come sit with me? Some nights I come here and there's no one interesting to talk to. Some nights, there's just one person. Tonight, it's you. Why oh. is that? I know what I like. Do you? Oh. What do you think of the music here? Dark rhythms, violent pulses. It stirs something primitive in me. What about you? She got her malt. She got a malt. I'm curious about a band called Expel 10. They get in my head and tear it to pieces. 
They're in concert soon. Maybe we should go together. You can lose yourself in the music here. There are ways to enhance that. You know? What do you think of Halix? It slithers through my soul. Seems like we share some interests. Do you know anything about art? It speaks to the darkest places in me. What about you? Do you know the artist Porta? I didn't think anyone around here knew him. He's sublime. Art comes in many varieties. I've seen vids that were more powerful than a sculpture sitting in a gallery. Do you know Vanya? My favorite. The two actresses on it are so glamorous. I'll have to watch it. Maybe we could do that together. God. Travel. I've traveled all over the galaxy. It changes you, doesn't it? I like the danger. Real travel means going to dangerous places. Where you can see and do things most people can't imagine. Yes. When I travel, I find myself drawn to dark, dangerous places. Violent places? Violence is the surest expression of power. Violence is a means to an end. Power is that end. Do you want to get out of here? My apartment is nearby and I want you alone. Okay. Uh, talk, yep. In plain sight. Hiding in plain sight. Oh, oh. Flirting. Most difficult game. Start. Have a Halix if you want. But wouldn't you rather have all your senses be clear and sharp right now? I, I certainly do. See what you have here. Oh. I was into dueling for a while. I love the moment you see it in your opponent's eyes. He knows you're better, and he's going to die. But dueling is without death. I'm almost sure. I'm almost sure about that. Oh, big boy. A gift from a suitor. The statue's got more personality than he did. Still, he impressed me enough that he finally got what he wanted. It didn't end the way he hoped. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, he even reveals that. I love any game where your opponent can believe he is about to win just before you kill him. Aren't you a teaser? Oh. And she's put. Hey, that's a mega. That looks pretty good. That's a nice view. Oh, she's just spoiling the surprises, or. Oh. That's not teasing the word I'm looking for. I love clubs. People, movement, heat. I can still hear the bass like the drums of a great hunt out for your blood. But here, it's muted, and you're safe. Is that what you want, Shepard? Oh. I'd rather fight than hide. Yes. Better to take control of your fate. I've never understood the fascination with safety. Some of us choose differently. Independence over submission. I think we share that, you and I. Oh, I'm stronger. You compare us, but you're nowhere near my league. Oof. So strong. I need this. What did you just... Do? Look into my eyes and tell me you want me. Tell me you'd kill for me. Anything I want. To screw up. I'm not the victim you were hoping for. But you... Who are you? Oh no. I see what's going on. The bitch herself found a little helper. Ooh. Lauren! <laughs> uh, mother. Do not call me that. I can't choose to stop being your daughter. Mother. You made your choice long ago. What choice? My only crime was being born with the gifts you gave me. Enough, Morinth! I am the genetic destiny of the Asari, but they are not ready to reveal this. So I must die. You are a disease to be purged. Nothing more. I'm as strong as she is. Let me join you. I am already sworn to help you, Shepard. Let us finish this. 
I'm sorry, Samara. For the suicide run we're about to do. More info will join us. Green shot. Morinth will be more useful to me. Oof. You will regret your choice. Oof. Goodbye, ah. mother. I already regret it. But I never picked her, and now she's murdered. So it will be a good choice. Thank you, Shepard. My mother was as powerful as she was hateful. You helped me. Now I'll help you. Let me take my mother's place on your team. You don't seem to care at all about the death of your mother. Why should I? She was dead to me long ago. But I'll keep her alive for you so you don't have any complications with your crew. I'm a dead ringer for my belated mother. Few people can tell us apart. And I've practiced Wait. long and hard to mimic her in every way. What? <laughs> oh, are you gonna wear her armor? Have you absorbed your mother's powers? Don't be silly. I have a wide range of talents beyond my biotic abilities. Acting is one of them. It took years to perfect, but when I was younger, posing as my mother brought its advantages. How do you think I originally escaped from Thessia? Let me just slip into this horrible uniform and none will be the wiser. Okay. I'll watch. Let's go. This is going to be fun. Huh. Dominate. Let's see what the repercussions are. Commander, Legion would like to talk with you. Of course you would like that. Team status. Oh. Does she wear the paladin armor now? No, I won't allow it. I will put the black armor onto her. Oh boy. This feels wrong. Never seen a let's play where this happens. Oh, this gets done. Oh. I mean, does she still have the face or will she just look exactly and talk like Samara? Samara. How do you like my look, Shepard? Convincing? No one has a clue about Mother. It remains our little secret. Okay. She actually has totally the look in the face of her. Just the voice is a little bit different. Let's talk about everything. What do you think of Normandy's crew? They're an interesting bunch, but they're not you. That's minimal. What do you think of our mission? The Collectors are dangerous. I know I'd like them gone. Once that's accomplished, maybe you and I could celebrate. Mm-hmm. Isn't it risky speaking in your own voice, Morinth? I've spent centuries being discreet, dealing with any bug or probing eye. I've made sure that Edie can't listen in. We're safe here. I just want to be myself with you, Shepard. Okay. I... think I would have preferred more in faith, face to tell them apart. Oh, but I won't give her the nice white paladin armor. That feels wrong. You're so different from your mother. She was a terrible mother. She did her duty with precision and care, but no love. She taught us how to honor the goddess, to be good Asari. She even tried to teach us the value of self-denial. <laughs> I was a bit of a disappointment. Some people take it hard when they disappoint their parents. My mother disappointed me too, and my opinion is the one that matters. She was happy to lead a life devoid of pleasure and then die. But you die with or without honor, you're still dead. Take the pleasures you're offered. Uh-huh. What a third. If you try to seduce her or she tries to seduce you, she still kills you. You've been through a lot. I'm always fine, Shepard. I learned hundreds of years ago to look out for myself. We'll look out for you. But you have to look out for us, too. Of course. It's strange and new for me, but I'll do my best. I won't make trouble among your crew if that's what you're asking. Huh. 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 I bet when you're in a mission, it's still Samara with Samara's voice line. I mean, that's clever. 
So they save voice lines for more info. I won't tolerate any problems. Shepard, I'd never risk my place on your team. You're like no one I've encountered. You've been through a lot. I'm always fine, Shepard. I learned hundreds of years ago to look out for myself. How do you handle such a solitary life? I get lonely at times. I never really feel the love of another, at least not for long. I don't suppose there's anything I can do about that. But I want you to know something. My lovers spent their last moments experiencing pleasure you can't imagine. Like Neff. She died because her nervous system overloaded, with an ecstasy so great she couldn't handle it. Why tell me this? It's just something to think about. You're unique. You've lived through the impossible. If anyone could survive, now's not the time. <laughs> oh, yes, I see it coming. You're trying to talk me into that. I should go. So uh -huh. soon. Well, don't stay away too long. Oh, God damn. <laughs> oh, God damn. That's such a big difference, though. Oh. <laughs> oh. Can't we just take both of them on our team? Where's the mod for that? That could be a mod, I'm sure of it. Okay, tell me. Legion. Shepard Commander, we have completed our analysis of the Reaper's data core. Did you find anything useful? We were sent to the old machine to preserve the Geth's future. We are prepared to reveal how. The heretics have developed a weapon to use against Geth. You would call it a virus. It is stored on a data core provided by Sovereign. Over time, the virus will change us. Make us conclude that worshipping the old machines is correct. If it were released, how quickly would this virus spread through your people? We are networked via FTL convoys. Most would change within a day. Isolated platforms would remain unaffected until they rejoined the network. I thought Geth couldn't be hacked or get viruses, at least for more than a few seconds. Altered programs are restored from archives. New installations are deleted. This heretic weapon introduces a subtle operating error in our most basic runtimes. The equivalent of your nervous system. An equation with a result of 1.33382 returns as 1.33381. This changes the results of all higher processes. We will reach different conclusions. So the reason they worship the Reapers is a math error? It is difficult to express. Your brain exists as chemistry, electricity. Like AIs, you are shaped by both hardware and software. We are purely software, mathematics. The heretic's conclusion is valid for them. Our conclusion is valid for us. Neither result is an error. An analogy. Heretics say one is less than two. Geth say two is less than three. So why did you need to go to the Reaper Corps? The heretics store the code in a quantum storage device Sovereign provided. To find and destroy the virus, we needed to understand its code and data storage structures. You know where this thing is? The heretics headquarters station on the edge of the terminus. We will provide coordinates. Normandy stealth systems are necessary to safely approach. What defenses should we expect? In space, none. Within, mobile platforms of various configuration and non-sentient defense turrets. How many Geth? There may be billions of individual programs. Fortunately, most will be uploaded to the central computer. Only a few mobile platforms are maintained at any time. Others are manufactured when needed. What's the plan once we get aboard? The Geth will disrupt their network, prevent the station's defenses from focusing on us. The Reaper data core is physically isolated from the network. We will need to be escorted to it to access and destroy the data. They built stations in the terminus? Where is this thing? Between stars. Organics have no cause to look there. But why do they build stations outside Geth territory in the first place? The heretics seek improvement from the old machines. In exchange, they help them attack organics. We condemn these judgments. Heretic Headquarters. Sounds like we could end their raids once and for all. Let's do it. Total victory is a possibility. We cannot judge the odds at this time. Regardless, we will begin preparations. That's his loyalty mission. 
I want to do the mission where we finally getting close to the end. Otherwise, I need to. I won't do another loyalty mission. Who do we have? Miranda has his loyalty. Jack Grant, Say Masani. Maybe I will have to do one. No. Damn it, why am I going up there? Wrong. Ah, so I will probably have to do missions to all. No messages for you, Commander. God damn it. God damn it. I can try exploring the Normandy crash site once more. At some point I will get called by the elusive man. Maybe it works this time. Otherwise I will have to find out what I want to do mission-wise in the meantime. Safe here. Okay, yes, that's the safe I'm gonna reload. Or 22. After my bad suicide business is done. Can I do that now, baby? Let's see if we're gonna have another black screen of doom. Oh no, look at that. We actually can check a date. Fine. I wish I could bring crewmates. The ambience is nice. Might have to download that for me. Oh, I see a Mako. Do you see a Mako? Why do I have my guns with me? Collect Doctor Exterior. I see a Mako. Do you see a Mako? Do you see a Mako? I see something. More dog tags. Maybe of crew members. Two of twenty, damn. Oh, I don't even want to do that then. There's always one I'm gonna miss. Get them gold. Find lost crew. That. This planet is looking cool though. God, I probably won't even find all of them. What are you? Oh, element zero. It's a nice looking planet though. And I definitely want the ambience music. I need an ambience playlist. Just for the empty parts of Mass Effect. Ship music and such. It doesn't exist. That's the cockpit. Twelve. Eight out of twenty. 
I'm just guessing some Aras loyalty mission didn't take too long. I rushed through it anyways. I knew exactly what to say. Third master shepherd over here. He should have just went in and say, we're gonna bang. Okay. It's a done deal. Oh! Huh. Okay, okay, Olenko. Where am I? Why did this turn me around? Are those Cadence Dog Tags? To beyond Skullic Sai. How can they even tell me the names? Not like I know my crew's name. Everybody who doesn't shoot is worthless. I knew it. Elements here, isn't that where it got out? Dog text. Right next to my shuttle. Is that my shuttle? No. Oh. That's my shuttle. I can already tell you there's always gonna be one that's missing that I can't find. Always. Who this? Baki Apishek. Okay. Draven Rosamund. Rosamund Pike. Is that the cockpit? So I'm not in there already. That's the cockpit. That's where Choker sits. Yep. Do we have two cockpits? Damn, that armor looks the best, maybe. Ah, uh, I don't know if it was a mass effect. Three mods, but uh, I have the... I have mass effect Andromeda armors in one of the games. That I modded in. One of the real cool armors. I'm not quite sure what it's called. The architect armor, something like that. So when I play Mass Effect 3, I will have those armors, I believe. Two more. One is under those crates. And one probably next to this, where I'm speaking. Good, we're gonna find all of them and more elements zero. You get them all. Bakari, I mean. Okay. Now we can leave. Where's my shuttle? It's right here. There it is. Good. Good, 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 good. Maybe the elusive man lets us do that mission down then. No, I might have to go back to some place. Damn it. Okay. Yeah. Commander, you've oh. received a new message at your private terminal. Oh, thank you for my daughter. Oh, boy. That she was the one who killed my daughter. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, anyways, we're gonna save here. And with more info, we'll continue. Yay, everybody enjoys that. That's the wrong face cam. Yep, peace out.